On this trip, we are going to one of the smaller railroad bridges in the area. It's just down the street from where I live. And we right now we are walking in between two of the railroad tracks. The ties are still there, but the railings themselves are gone. Right there, all that yellow weeded area is one of them. And on the other side, it's the same thing, but the ties are still there saying that there was once a railroad track on both those areas. Right next to it is the Sulphur Creek. It's actually been fairly clean the past couple of years. And then this empties into the Red Shannon. Right there's a large board to something with a couple of railroad tracks sticking out of the ground behind it. Well, the only thing I don't like about this bridge is the uh, water company put a large green pipe on it and it just kind of takes away from it, but it was the only way across so I can understand. I have three or four more bridges lined up for these videos. And they each get a little bigger than this one. The four-wheelers, the people that ride this, have attempted to get across the bridge by putting pieces of plywood down, but they've either broke or rotted or just made it so they can't get across anymore. So this road here isn't very traveled anymore. And right there's the bridge. That water is about two and a half to three foot deep. I'm pretty sure there was probably another bridge along here at one point, or this one might have been wider because it only holds up for one set of the ties. So I'm thinking there might have been another one right here. But I'm not really 100% sure on any of that.
under the water, there's some really big boards under there.